Hello fellow engineers and welcome to Planet Crafter. So when we first started playing this game, we'd crash landed on this Martian planet that was all orange and sort of boring looking. And I spent hours and hours collecting resources, crafting stuff in the crafty machine until finally we ended up here with trees and a crap ton of butterflies as well as a blooming suspension bridge in the background. And yes, I did spend hours and hours off camera building all of these butterflies. I just wanted to see what they'd look like. And they look they look quite cool they didn't let me down but today it's time to move on in my terraforming plans uh, because i'm an engineer at heart i'm not a terraformer i don't terraform planets for a living well, i don't i don't even do engineering for a living technically i i do youtube now but i'm i want to build another bridge now this bridge is nice this bridge is good uh, one of the highest rated bridge reviews i've ever done however today i have bigger plans than this much bigger bigger pla well actually it's probably going to be a smaller bridge technically technically but that's details that is details uh we are going to be putting in a bridge over there hopefully a nice sort of arch bridge but we're not going to be making it out of normal materials like stairs and living compartments no 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 we're going to be making this bridge au natural because i found out at the end of last episode where are they where are they over here look this game is another one of those games where physics stop working if you leave things alone and these are eggplants and over here i have fields of eggplants growing so my my sort of thing that i'm gonna do i'm gonna spend a lot of hours making new eggplant farms and then we're going to make a nice little structure there and we're going to fill it with eggplants and then we're going to take the structure away and hopefully the bridge will stand so first off i need well i need water let's jump off this cliff down here head over to this lovely lovely water have a little bit of a slurp and then have a think about how we're going to get some more farms so if we press q we're in the construction menu we can go down and these are the outdoor farms so we need two bee lava for every farm a water bottle and fertilizers t1 and t2 as well as super alloy now that's quite a lot of resources but whilst i was farming for all these little butterfly things i've actually i've got a bare stack of bee lava saved up so mostly we're going to be focusing on the fertilizer t1 and t2 because i've also got a load of super alloy as well uh, but before we do anything let's head back to our original base now thankfully i have a teleporter here so we can head into the teleporter and go to our homer sweet homer and this will take us to our primary base the main base and these are all of our lockers filled with resources they're all suitably labeled so i know what everything is like eggy farts is obviously sulfur bug snacks are obviously bug, bug snacks. snacks they're filled with bugs so i'm gonna put everything in there that i don't need right and now i need to come over to here and i need to admire my trophy collection because it's it's very very impressive i don't know something about it just makes me makes me proud i guess uh, next up we'll head over this way because in this machine this is where we've got the recipes for the fertilizer and the fertilizer the t2 so to make that we need algae sulfur and eggplants so the sulfur is in here obviously if we head down this way the eggplants currently are over here but we're going to be moving probably all of these over to our new base. <laughs> there's so many eggplants I, I forgot how many there were and then if we head outside and jump off our base down to here look how many trees there are by the way pretty impressive all this green stuff under the water this is all algae so under here we can literally nom all of these up head back up into our base using the power of pressing the f4 button loads of times and then we can make lots of fertilizer mm, fertilizer next up to make fertilizer t2 we need the actual fertilizer which we've got algae squash and methane so so over here i have been growing some squash as you can see there so we'll grab a squash and then back outside if we head down here admire the very strong technology that has put all these trees on the surface of this planet and then head over to this equally impressive machine this is making us methane so we can grab the methane head back up to our base and make the fertilizer t2 mm, fertilizer t2 and then if we rinse and repeat that a few times grab the super alloy out of our super alloy locker as well as going to our food seed locker because i have quite a lot of eggplant seeds already saved up here so i want to grab as many of these as i can and then back into our teleporter we can head back to the bilf and you might wonder why is it called bilf well that is why soon to be joined by another one no doubt then we can come over to our farms we can go to the construction menu and build an outdoor farm and if we just rotate this so it's the same orientation we can build another farm next to the one we already have and if we go into this and we can put an eggplant seed inside of there and that one eggplant seed will turn into five lovely eggplants like these ones over here and then if i get enough of these essentially the big pile of eggplants 
we've got over there. In the same amount of time with these, we should be able to make five times as many because we're making five eggplants. So I can grab all of these, shove them down there for now, and then these will continue growing new eggplants, meaning our pile will get bigger and bigger, meaning we should have enough to be able to build the bridge over there. So since making those is going to take a long, long time, I will probably see you in a few hours. Bye. Right, so it's been a while. Look, we have we have them all set up. You can see the little eggplants growing. Look how small they are. So I think it's time. Hang on. Oxygen level low. Ah, I got to just get some oxygen. One second. Wait for the oxygen to go up. There we go. So we're going to we're going to start to make a bridge. Now, I feel like probably the stairs are the best way to try and get the arch. I do need I will need some other shapes. Now, the trouble with this game is it doesn't really let you build inside of things very easily. So for example, if we head in this direction, you might remember my first attempt at a bridge and it was also a bit of an arch bridge as well. Uh, not ideal that one, but I am sort of wondering if instead of blocks I were to use stairs, maybe that would allow me to get a better, a better edge and stuff. I'm just worried I might lose eggplants out the side and things. Don't know, not really sure how this is going to go if I'm honest, but hopefully in this pile we have some iron. Yes we do, so we can grab some iron. And then in these lockers that I have in my bridge, I've actually saved up loads of iron now. So we'll grab a load of those and we'll head over there and try and build something. And I'm actually going to do this on stream, so if you want to watch the entire build, go to my Twitch channel where you should be able to see the VOD. If not, head to my YouTube archive channel, because uh, all my VODs get stored there, so that's cool. In the meantime, time you're probably going to see a montage of me building this and then hopefully we can skip to the final product so i'll see you on the other side by the way suit bird i'm gonna make you edit this so you're gonna have to watch this twice <laughs> Well, so I've just loaded up the game. It's the day after the night before or whatever. Um, let's go take it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't say all that work has gone. Please, please just say it hasn't loaded. Please just say it hasn't loaded. Please. Oh, there it is. There they are. There's my beautiful eggplants. There they are. It's running surprisingly well this game so yeah we finished the eggplant bridge in stream last time so i guess now is the time to deconstruct all of this and uh see what it looks like i guess so boosh boosh let's get rid of the roof all right so the roof is gone there's still there's a few floating eggplants about but um let's start getting rid of the edges and underneath i mean it looks like the eggplants they're not falling so that is one positive <laughs> there's so many eggplants it is ridiculous all right so let's try and land on the oh actually i can just delete them from up here that's handy that is very handy oh look under here <laughs> Uh, if you're wondering what those what those poos falling down are, they're the bits of iron because my inventory is full now. So every one of these I destroy. Uh, the game's trying to give me iron, but I am rejecting that iron. Oh, look at the mess down there. All the desks. Oh, this is this is crazy, even for you, Matt. I think you might have gone a bit too far this time. I'm about to die of oxygen. I've got some oxygen tanks. That's good. First time for everything, me having oxygen. Look, there's a load of desks under here. Oh, look, there's a safety rail in there. We won't be needing that. Right, so I think that's everything on this side. That's all pretty baked in there. Oh, look at it from down here. Oh, I know YouTube compression is going to absolutely kill this. Oh no, I'm running low on food. Where am I going to get some food from? If only there are some spare eggplants about somewhere. Anyway, we'll just keep destroying all of these and then I don't know what I'm going to do about all these desks. I mean, I could do that, but it seems a bit excessive. Now there's a lot of iron in this bridge. <laughs> iron and eggplants, a balanced diet. Right, there's lots of desks here. I don't think they're structural. I am a bit scared to get rid of them, but sod it. I've done it now. Now, each one of these is two iron, so there's going to be iron for these. Oh, man. How many of these desks did I spawn? There's so many. Right. 
<laughs> it looks terrible from down here. But there you go. I think the bridge is pretty much done. Let's go get a view of it from like the sides and the top because down here really is not doing it justice. So we'll head back over. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, it disappears out of my field of view. Devs, why? I can barely see it. That's not that's not the whole bridge. It goes all the way over there. All right, come on, graphics. There's got to be field of view. Field of... Oh, no, not field of view. View distance. Draw distance. There's nothing. There's absolutely nothing. But let's turn, let's turn the HUD off. Look at this. Look at this bridge. Oh, my goodness. I feel like there's a bridge review coming. This eggplant bridge is made out of 129,000 eggplants, probably. I don't even know. I don't want to know. What we once considered a bilf has now changed forever since the eggplant arch is the new standard for engineering. Ah, oh, but there is the full span in all its glory. It sort of hurts my frame rate a little bit to look at it. And despite the waterfalls of eggplants, even the rain can't dampen my spirits on this i mean they can i'm absolutely gutted i can't see it from that side of the canyon but anyway i give this eggplant bridge i mean if i'm being honest i'm gonna i'm gonna give it like a 8.4 out of 10 bridge review so yeah not not gonna lie a little bit disappointed in the draw distance of this game i thought i honestly thought this was gonna be an absolute 10 out of 10 piece of engineering uh, but i mean an 8.4 is not bad although i probably have broken my save file now because i mean <laughs> the game is not gonna like loading this every single time anyway i am just going to do a little bit of a cleanup of all the floating eggplants oh no my inventory's full where am i gonna drop these eggplants well yeah i can literally just drop them here i can't believe how much time i spent on this like <laughs> it took so long and i've got to i gotta make floating platforms just so i can get a good angle of it for the thumbnail still no regrets no regrets except wait now i don't need to build these because the devs built me a special version of the game meaning we can see it from anywhere oh my computer is not happy with me right now but let me just grab some oxygen from in here go and delete all of these that i put down because now i don't need them and now i think it's only fair that we change our bridge review score so bridge review amended score walking along the bill you can now now see the eggplant bridge in all of its glory sort of if i can get the stairs out the way <laughs> whoa look at it the view from the front is amazing the view from underneath looking up is a well it's, it's not as amazing to be honest you can clearly see my my jagged edges there the view from the rear end is amazing for a change but the view from down here with a pillar of the built in between is really what makes this bridge stand out as well as once you mash f4 to get higher and higher into space because we now know that it won't disappear the rocks have disappeared but the eggplants are still there oh wow i wonder i wonder how high i can go before everything else disappears actually i've never i've never actually mashed f4 for this long oh i've just unlocked a fusion energy cell we'll have to use that in the next video but for now we're still in the bridge review so down there there's my old base for the warp gate right below me you can still see there are still eggplants they will not despawn ever unfortunately my oxygen is running out i gotta mash f4 as quick as possible to get as high as possible there's a lot to see in this map though look there's the waterfall thing there's the crater oh god and there's a there's a cliff of doom over the edge but yes the new score as I die is an 8.6 out of 10 bridge review you died and dropped some of your inventory oh my goodness where is that gonna fall did it fall or did it just there might just be a crate up there in the sky don't know but anyway devs thank you so much for making a super special build that eggplants don't despawn for me very very kind of you um and fair play for making a game that can actually allow me to view this like i'm sure on youtube you're really not getting the quality of that it's probably compressed to hell but uh, on my screen it looks absolutely delicious well not too delicious i mean eggplants they're, they're not the best fruit and yes they are fruit i thought they were vegetables but think about it. seeds inside means it's fruit but then strawberries exist i don't know we're going on a tangent so i'm gonna say peace and vegetable tangents. Bye, guys!